Tim Campbell has spoken out on finding out Lord Alan Sugar wanted to bring him on board to become one of his aides in the upcoming 16th series of The Apprentice. Tim Campbell, who won the 2005 edition of BBC's The Apprentice and later joined Alan Sugar's company Amstrad on a £100,000 salary, was left bewildered by the personal phone call from his former boss. The two appear to have remained in close contact since he left the firm in 2007. In a new interview with Radio Times, the 44-year-old gushed about his return to The Apprentice after 16 years, as a new lineup of contestants battles it out. When Tim saw a phone call from Alan, he recalled thinking, Is this a prank? I thought people were going to burst in with cameras and say, Got you. But it turned out that the offer was, in fact, the real deal. Alongside Alan, Tim will also join the latter's longtime ally and advisor Baroness Karen Brady. Claude Littner ditched the latest series to recover from a horrific injury, after falling off an electric bike in April. Tim continued, I'm quite anal and data focused. Everyone in my contacts book has their middle name and whether they're a doctor or an OBE. I thought, why is he phoning? When he explained, I said, are you being serious? It was mad. Over the years, Tim has remained in Alon's circle of contacts despite leaving his business just two years after joining. Regardless of how much time has passed since the two have professionally worked together, it seemed apparent that Tim was the ideal candidate Alan would hire for the job during his search for Claude's replacement. He was so fundamental to the change in my life, he said of Alan. I've always respected what he did for me because he could have put me in a broom cupboard. But he invested in me. Lord Sugar is about the circle of people he trusts, so I was honored that the relationship we had meant he could pick up his phone, tell me about the difficult circumstances that had arisen, and ask me to join the panel. Season 15 concluded at the end of 2019 before production for a follow-up series was halted due to COVID-19.